does he write here? What else does he write here? I don't know. I wrote him a whole bunch of stuff. This guy can't even write properly. Overhead press 365 strict. I, I overhead press 365 strict and bench press 500. Natty. So do I. So what? When I was young, I did the same thing. And big deal. Big fucking deal, man. Uh, if you're going to use fictitious arguments from anecdotes or the argument from authority, fallacy, then I'm ready. I'm, I'm already correct by something to you. You're not correct by anything. You're fake. Get it? You're fake, guy. Jesus, man, this is this is uh, this is gut wrenching. Answering these things and talking about this shit. If you can't point to a single document instance of hyperplasia in humans, I did. I've got several studies. They did studies from 18 to 32. Hyperplasia. It's on my fucking channel. How many times do I have to fucking tell you people? And also, I talked about another one from a university study. Get it? It doesn't do you any good to claim it's occurring without evidence. Listen to me, man. It's not whether or not it works. It does work. But does it work in every instance when you're lifting a heavy weight? No, it doesn't work in hyper hyperatrophy. Get it? It's hyperplasia. But you get hyperatrophy when you do hyperplasia. Understand me? It comes out of it. And not these animal studies. Yeah, they got animal studies on hypertrophy too. What, am I supposed to talk about that as well? They got you duped in the industry. They left the other one out. They left the puzzle out. Get it? Then he says, Hyperplasia only exists under extreme heavy loads with progressive tension overload with low volume. That's not how it works. And I'm not going to explain it anymore. One of your other videos also cites myofibular hypertrophy versus sarcoplasma, which is well-debunked myth. No, it's not. You never even read the study, guy. Jesus, I'll put that study too down there as well. Maybe I gotta put them all there. You gotta reread them. Cytoplasm ratio stays constant when hypertrophy occurs. You're repeating a large debunked thing from 70s and 80s. This is from 70s and 80s. It's been around forever, get it? No, they don't, and you're small in, whatever. What is this guy's? So you see the stuff that I gotta put up with? These are, look, I can't even go into the rest of this. These guys keep writing me, they kept trying to challenge me. Man, there's no challenge, get it? There's no challenge. I'm gonna repeat one more time. PubMed. The reason why you're not getting any bigger, the reason why you say you're getting stronger, and lifting that heavy weight, you power lifters, and you're not getting any bigger, because the androgen myositic receptor, this, the myositic androgen receptor is responsible for strength. Get it? It is not responsible for the mass of limbs. The, to get the mass bigger, you need more metabolic stress and you're not providing enough by lifting a heavy weight off the floor. You're relieving the metabolic stress. That metabolic stress has to be constant. Get it? Like Milo from Croton. Lifting a heavy bowl, remember? 